What's going on everyone? Hope you are having a great day as always. In this video, I'm gonna be discussing Own the Day, Own Your Life audiobook slash book by Aubrey Marcus. And I had finished it almost a month ago. It was a pretty quick audiobook. And I'm just gonna give you a general overview of the audiobook. And I'm also gonna put up some other suggestions on the screen here for books that I finished. I'm gonna add this to my audiobook recommendation slash book recommendation playlist series on YouTube which has been ongoing for a few years now, and I feel like this is a great addition. So generally speaking, I found the book to be pretty well put together, and it was very straightforward, it was very simple, dumbed down, uh, very approachable for the everyday person, and not too overwhelming, like too many things that you need to do and take care of. And I like the way that Aubrey basically broke it down to a single day. A lot of authors do this, a lot of people tend to do this. They focus on the individual day at hand. For instance, this day right now, it is a Tuesday morning, and here I am out with my big boy, and we're just doing our uh, morning routine, which typically includes, you know, trekking and hiking around some mountain top, hill top things, and towards the water here, and, you know, it's, it's very, very much required as part of uh, my to start my day and part of my morning routine. So I found it interesting that Aubrey's book really focuses on movement, light, hydration, just really the basics of what a human being should naturally be doing. And it's funny because we've, we've gone so far away from doing these things naturally that, and I talk to a lot of people, they'll wake up and they'll have coffee and they'll be in their bed, not even having, haven't even gotten out of bed and they're having their coffee and they're sitting there on their social media on their phone and they're just flipping through. So their day, before their day even really kicks off and starts, meaning they set foot on the ground outside of bed, they're already drinking coffee, uh, they're already on their social media and you know just consuming that. So this is not a very natural way of living in my opinion and obviously in Aubrey's as well because his book was focused on basically giving you the instructional guide, a very simple how-to guide in terms of uh, how to structure your day for success. And part of that, his suggestion was to go outside in the morning, get light, get movement, and hydrate. See, I naturally do these things because I have this guy right here, and I've had a Doberman before this one, and I have another dog as well, so we just do this. This is part of it. Also, if I'm not out doing this naturally, I feel, I feel a sense of lack. I feel like something's missing. I feel like I need to, to move. I need that light. I need that hydration. See, I make a lot of videos and content driven around much of what was discussed in Own the Day, Own Your Life uh, book. I do it in separate videos, so I talk about hyd hydration, I talk about the importance of hydration, I talk about the importance of getting good sleep, I talk about uh, supplementation, nootropics, and really just about, uh, just about everything that was in that book. Uh, and a lot of people do, but Aubrey put it together in a very nice, uh, well thought out, concise manner with some good, uh, well backed research from, um, you know, people such as Dr. Rhonda Patrick. And it was really enjoyable. I, I, I wouldn't say that it was extremely challenging, a challenging audiobook. See, I, I have a, a bunch of different types of books I listen to. I listen to a lot of like science, physics, uh, philosophy type of books, chemistry, biochemistry, but then I'll also because sometimes those ones are very hard to always listen to because they require a lot of um, processing power. You need to, you, you know, I would rather listen to complex books in the morning or in the early sort of mid-afternoon as opposed to later in the evening because I'm kind of burnt out, tired, I don't really have the energy to consume physics or at least retain the information that's being presented. So Aubrey's book is really great because it allowed me to take a break from the difficult books to listen to his which his is just a gentle reminder for me of the things that need to be, that I need to do and that need to be done on a daily basis. And if, and this is why I think his book is really great if you aren't too tuned in with the daily requirements of a, of a successful functional uh, type of day where you, know, you wake up and you go outside, you get exercise, you get fresh air, you get hydration, and you're properly taking supplements throughout the day, and you're getting your exercise, uh, and you, you, know, you have a healthy, uh, active sex life or sex drive and it's not dysfunctional in any way and, and you know just generally your whole life isn't dysfunctional you, you sort of have things you know in order in order basically so it's a gentle reminder for me and if, if you as a uh, watcher of this review video find that you don't have things in order in your day-to-day -day routine and you would like some guidance or assistance or just a very simple straightforward 
um, instructional book then I would suggest Own the Day, Own Your Life by Aubrey. And aside from that, I do enjoy the fact that he narrated the, narrated the audiobook himself on Audible because I always like when the authors do that. So um, that's just a general opinion of the book and a general review. I don't want to give away the book because I never like doing that. Um, if you're interested in other audiobook reviews, I did uh, 12 Rules for Life by Jordan Peterson, An Antidote to Chaos, and I've done many other books in the series. So definitely check those out. I'm going to get moving more because... We need to finish our little hike trek here. But I want to thank you for watching this video as always. Thank you for listening to this and consuming it. And if you're interested in the book, check out the link in the description below. If you want more information on the book, shoot me a message or a comment on social media, including on this video. Just comment down below or hit me up on Instagram. I'm always more than happy to have a discussion. So thank you for watching this video as always. I hope it was informative to you and I hope you're considering purchasing the book because again, it is, it is a worthwhile listen and it's quick, easy, just get it in the bank. And uh, you can always go back to it if you want, but I don't personally find it one of those ones that has a lot of replay value for me. Maybe for you, who knows. So I hope this helps again. Thank you for watching. Give it a thumbs up. I'll catch you again in the next one.